Hi everyone. So we are back with middle term splitting today. We have a quadratic expression. This is not an equation because it doesn't have equal to sign. So first of all, this is quadratic because the maximum power of variable, the maximum power of variable is 2. So this whole thing is called quadratic expression. Not equation because it doesn't have any equal to sign. Okay. So now we need to factorize it using middle term splitting. Middle term splitting means which is the middle term? This one. Because this expression has three terms, so we can call it a trinomial as well. Trinomial. It's a polynomial but having three terms, so trinomial. Okay, I hope you understood till now. Now let's get started with factorization. Okay, so in middle term splitting, let me write it again x square plus 10x plus 24. Okay, what is the middle term? 10. We need to split this, that's why the name. Okay, we need to split this. But how? Okay, so let's start it. One second. We need to go for the constant first. Write constant. Write all the factors. Okay, now start writing like this. Start from very first, very smallest times table 1. 1 times 24. If that's a prime number, you're gonna get 1 and that number only. But 24 is not a prime number, so 1 times 24 gives you 24. 2 times 12 gives you 24. 3 times 8 gives you 24. 4 times 6 gives you 24. 5 times nothing. 6 times, but 6, the factor 6 we have already used here, 7 we don't get and then next one is 8, 9 in 9 times table, there is no 24 as a multiple, so next is 12, next is 24, so I hope it makes sense. So, till here, till here we have written all the factors, 1, 24, 2, 12, 3, 8 and 4, 6. Okay. Understand this part very clearly because this the, this one is the important part now. Now we need to make 10, the middle term itself, 10. We need to make 10 using the factors, the pair of factor. Okay. Now 2 and 12, 2 and 12 gives you 10. You can do addition or subtraction. Okay. So how can you make 2 and 12 a 10? 12 minus 2 is a 10, right? That means you can write this 10x as 12x minus 2x, right? Okay. It is making 10x, but on multiplying these numbers individually, like positive 12 and negative 2 should make, on multiplying, they should make 24. Are they making 24? Nope. 12 times negative 2 is negative 24. So, this is not our answer. Okay. Now, check other pair. We know 3 and 8 don't make 24. Sorry, 3 and 8 don't make 10, right? But, voila. Okay. 4 and 6 do make a 10 and on multiplication, they do make 24 as well. So, this one is our correct pair, right? Now, I need to continue this. Next step would be x square. Then, I need to split this term now. Then, write plus 24 as it is. Okay. Now, split that middle term in form of 6x plus 4x. Okay. Now, make a pair here. Make a pair here. What can you take common in these two terms? First two terms. X 
what would be left in the bracket? 1x from here, 1 6 from here. Okay. What can you take out common from these two? A 4. So an x would be left, a 6 would be left. Make sure that you know that these two brackets should be same. They have to be com coming same. So, till now we got x times x plus 6 plus 4 times x plus 6. Now, this term has x plus 6. This term has x plus 6 again. That means we can take x plus 6 common again. And in this term, what is left? Just the x. And in this term, what is left? Just the 4. Because we have taken those brackets out. Now, I just factorized my quadratic trinomial into x plus 6, x plus 4. That's the answer. So, when, while checking, first of all, this is the answer. Now, while checking, if you multiply them together, first, only this is the answer. Don't get confused. Now, if you need to check the answer for checking, If you multiply them together, like with the lobster method or you can say foil method, this to this plus this times this, you're gonna get eventually this, this 24, which was our question again, right? So, this was the checking method. Don't get confused. Your answer was finished till here. I hope you understood it and this is your answer. Thanks for watching. So, how to do middle term splitting? That's how. Thanks for watching guys.